Right, so let's um, take 7 eighths minus 1 half. So what do we end up with? So maybe you have 7 eighths of an inch and you want to subtract 1 half of an inch. What we need to do first when we're subtracting fractions or when we're adding fractions, we need to get a common denominator. So right now we have 2 and 8. We'd like these to be the same. 2 times 4, that's 8. So I'm just going to do 2 times 4 here, and then I'll have 8 down here and over here. But I can't just multiply the denominator by 4. I do need to multiply the numerator by 4 as well, because 4 divided by 4, that's 1. So we're just multiplying 1 times 1 half. It's still 1 half. But now we take our 7 eighths, and we subtract 1 times 4 is 4. 2 times 4 is 8. 4 eighths, that's the same as 1 half. But when I subtract 7 minus 4, that gives me 3. Keep the 8 the same. And I end up with 3 eighths. So 7 eighths minus 1 half gives us 3 eighths. This is Dr. B. Thanks for watching.